Hi, my name is Simon. You're listening to the Simon Says Podcast. Hi, everyone. Uh, pardon for uh, of all the uh, strange, long silences. This is my very first podcast, of course. I always wanted to start this. And, um, okay, I wanted to do a YouTube first. But I dis- uh, discovered that podcast could be a little bit easier because I already have the mic that I needed so let's start and I think with the idea where I got for this idea from another podcaster her name is Carly Hartman uh, she's the daughter of Butch Hartman the incredible uh, animator and cartoonist yeah animator and cartoonist uh, who worked at Nickelodeon for, pardon me if I'm cr- wrong, uh, 30 years more, more or less, I think so. Um, she did a podcast, uh, her podcast, the best day ever podcast. You can find it on all podcast streaming services. After listening to her podcast, uh, it sounded much so much fun. So I thought, why not try it myself? So. After a year of the mic <laughs> just laying around doing nothing, twiddling its thumbs, I think it has thumbs, um, I said to myself, wow, it sounds good, let's try it. So, and that's another thing, pardon my voice, I'm a little sick, but I'm getting, I'm going out of it, um, is, is that I was at home alone, really shy guy, and, uh, I said to myself, okay, right, I, I've got the chance, I'm at home alone, I've uh, got my compu- a brand new computer to basically perfect to do, do, do the opportunity, and let's do this. Okay, so here I am, in front of a mic, as I said on my Twitter account, it's like looking down the barrel of a gun, basically, it's, I'm scared of it, hell, it's like this big black object sitting in front of me just looking and staring at me with its blue blue LED light um, yeah as I said uh, it's my first podcast so please enjoy uh, I think my first episode I'm gonna do today is gonna to introduce myself so as most people do on the internet they keep their identities a secret like a superhero Superman Batman Iron Man Iron Man. I think he has a song titled like that in South Africa. Anyways, um, my name is Simon, but I'm gonna call my stage name Simon Says. So I'm Simon Says, and this I am 29 years old. Yeah, 29 years old. I live in South Africa. See, ha! You thought I'm gonna reveal my location? Nope, I'm gonna blur it out in editing. And um, basically, I work as a delivery man at the moment. Any YouTuber, podcaster, you know, that does has a daily do- daytime job. So basically, yeah, I have a bit daytime job. I do deliveries for a business where my parents work at. Um, and basically, yeah, so I do deliveries for the business, town, to the town, back, between the businesses, farms, we live, work on a farm, I'm not going to give the identity away, um, yeah, so I do deliveries with my own delivery vehicle, and that's my daily day job. Uh, now what, now you want to know, who is this Simon Says? Well... Uh, I am, as I said, I already know, 29 years old, and the thing is, I am, my top favorite hobby to do, basically, is, I'm a total techie. No, I don't mean the shoe that you buy in South Africa, but we call a techie. A techie, I mean as in gadgets, gizmos, and games, and you name it, basically, I get completely, completely excited, like a kid at Christmas. You can put the latest tablet, smartphone, computer in front of me and I I don't even need to read the manual. That's how 
deep and excited I am about gadget gizmos and technology basically TVs DSTVs uh, satellite uh, um, home theater systems you name it I love it anything that has, takes power and it is gadget related or technology related I, that is my jam I love technology um, as I said as I sitting here my room is covered in technology basically I this is the computer in front of me it's my 4k TV my home theater system basically yeah I am I'm one of those cartoony style people who has this bedroom and looks like normal on the outside but when you step inside it looks like a freaking department store with all the latest gadget gizmos and all that so yeah that's one of my other uh, one hobbies the other one is a good spot of gaming oh yeah I love a good racing game but a little the last few years I have been starting to love a good shoot em again like uh, my first shooter game before when I was deeply deeply just in racing games my first sh first person shooter was Uncharted Uncharted um, for the PS3 I uh, got it in a bundle pack when I bought my first PlayStation 3 just when it no no not just when it came out uh, I think after release date that's when I got the bundle pack with the PlayStation 3 with the one terabyte hard drive I think and the Uncharted game yeah that's where I got the game and I thought to myself ah, I'm not gonna play this it's gonna just gonna lay there and gather dust and uh, lo and behold I fell madly in love with Uncharted lovely game I love it I just I'm itching to get the final installment Uncharted 4 um, I know it's an old game but I haven't played it yet I need to play that game uh, yeah that's my second uh, enjoyment and hobby so my next one which I have also have a deep deep passion which is in collecting and in watching and that is movies oh yeah I love a good movie not just any movie okay I watch some anim uh, action movies but my number one genre of movie that I love to watch is um, animation now animation some people would say yeah it's just ink on paper or pixels and all that it isn't it's just it and animation movies does things that a normal movie can't do and that is create an imaginary world that you can actually see it, it basically no studio can make a set as inter not interactive but um, as awesome as an animation world and sometimes animation can make an original movie even better like some reboots uh, yeah so I love animation and on top of that my biggest planning thing I've ever planned in my entire life is going to be a trip I'm planning for next year I've never done this before I have never done it before and I think it would be something different in my life and that would be I'm planning my very first trip overseas and uh, and that is the, the world capital of movies and that is Los Angeles California um, yeah so I'm going to Los Angeles California uh, to do to make a true dream come true of mine and that is basically one basically is Los Angeles because who doesn't want to visit Los Angeles uh, the second is basically to visit the number one tourist attraction in Los Angeles and that is visiting Walt Disney World oh yeah Walt Disney World the home of the big mouse yes Mickey Mouse um, ever since I was young I always wanted to go uh, visit Disneyland basically in general but at Disneyland um, yeah so I've 
the story I've seen ever since I posted that last video of me sitting in a pickup truck talking. Uh, I have saved up quite a amount of money. I'm not going to reveal the amount, but uh, I am surely halfway there. I just need to do the rest of the planning of the trip, and uh, you can be assured that I am going to record that entire trip on video and I'll be posting it on my YouTube channel on the Simon Says YouTube channel where I'll be po also be posting my podcasts where you guys can enjoy and listen uh, as I said I am grateful for all this uh, the, the, the YouTube support that I have on my channel um, because hold on let me just check here quickly yeah, with all my, my entire 712 subscribers, um, I think this is maybe something I never expected to do. I always wanted to do, but I never thought I'd have 712 subscribers. Okay, but that is a reason for that is because of one particular video, and that is a video I posted about four years ago. And that is of the video called Wackhead. Ons praat Afrikaans en nie Engels gepraat. Now you may be wondering what video is this? Now you can go back into my YouTube channel and go to the very first video I posted on that channel. And you can go and watch it. It's basically, backstory is, go for, you for back four years ago. I was uh, at home uh, unemployed at the moment. At, at, at that time and um, basically and I was this and I'm still this huge fan of Darren Wackhead Simpson South Africa's number one phone pranking celebrity basically um, at that time he was working at Highfeld Stereo Johannesburg's number one radio station and um, he was this you in he still is this huge radio DJ, a uh, 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 presenter basically, not DJ presenter. Oh, and DJ basically, and he did these phone call pranks called Wackets. Win no, well, what's the correct the pronunciation? I just think it's Wackets pranks, phone pranks. Uh, morning rude awakening yeah darren simpson's rude awakening it's basically and he does this pranks where people email him and say right uh, prank my dad or prank my mother father sister whoever is gullible enough to fall for this he calls them uh, he, he gets an email and the guy gives the idea of the prank basically and then your contact details now and the one day I decided right let's do this and uh, and I took my smartphone out at back then I had a Blackberry <laughs> pardon me a Blackberry and uh, I emailed him saying yeah you go. I'm gonna give you the entire description but you will hear in the video uh, um, about uh, we uh, the, uh, the rental service we have on our uh, satellite service we can rent movies and so on and, and long story short and I emailed him and around about that same day around five o'clock the afternoon I get this phone call oh no no no, no wait sorry sorry, sorry pardon me uh, um, before that I got an email he said quite a uh, cool he loves the idea and uh, he'll get in touch and uh, I thought, okay, it will be, what, a few days later, maybe, depends. And uh, it literally that same day, he called me on this private phone number, which is maybe the studio's private telephone number. And he called me. And I'm there, I'm, I'm standing there with this phone on my ear, and I'm like this kid, like, Shivering, I mean, and I'm still the, I'm the same to this day. Shivering. 
oh my goodness, it's Darren Wackett Simpson. He just called me. And it's like, and exactly like those cartoon characters, it's like, uh, 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 I'm just squeezing out words, whatever sentence and words that's in my mind, I'm squeezing out. And every time I'm talking, it feels like it's the worst thing ever. And, uh, okay, pardon the, the, the little delays in between because I'm just waking up the computer. I don't want to know why it keeps slipping that quickly. Anyways, and, uh, yeah. And I'm just standing here talking with him, and it's like everything going through my mind is like, this is Darren Simpson, this isn't Darren Simpson, this isn't Darren Simpson. And, anyways. And, um, yeah, and I'm, and as I'm talking, I'm describing him to him, and to him, he asks me a few questions, and so on, and, and immediately, he switches over to the two-phone, uh, um, conference call. Me on the other side, he in the middle, and on the other side, the person he called to prank. And, well... All I can say is you can go and listen to the prank on the video. Uh, I made it myself back in the day. Um, it's not one of the best videos you can, best editing jobs, but uh, yeah, I, I made it what I can do, what I did, and uh, yeah, that is the video that basically gave me my head start on over 700 plus subscribers um i think i'm going to start wrapping up on this very very first podcast and uh, say i hope you guys enjoy it uh give it a like subscribe and also if you have something to say leave a comment down below on in on the youtube video um right i think see you guys next time I'll try to post another one as soon as possible. As I said, I am a bit busy in the week, but I'll try doing it over the weekend. And yeah, this is my, this is Simon Says' very first podcast. And leave me a comment. Let me know what would you like to change? Uh, my speaking habits, my, what stories would you like to know? Um, anything, just leave a comment down below and I'll try to check them out. Uh, see you and thanks for listening. Bye